No, 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 no. Right, trouble. You've been headbutting me. Look at this. Little headbutter. There is a goat on the camera right now. Good morning mud monsters and welcome along for another day's digging. I'm out on my little pasture permission. This is the second time I've been out here. First time I came there was loads of Georgian coins and um, a surprise of a little hammy. So um, who knows what's going to come up today. I'd, I'd expect some more Georgian coins but could there be any more silvers? I'd really like to get a silver milled coin or maybe a bit of gold. You never know. The estate nearby is clearly well to do so there could be some gold coins kicking around. Um, I've got a couple of meadows to go at, um, one with some rather frustratingly annoying goats in them. <laughs> so uh, I'll have to see how I get on with those. Um, sheep in the other ones and then there's one which is completely open. So hopefully there won't be any hassle from animals there. But anyway, enough talking for me. Let's get out there and let's get digging. Right, first find of the day then. It appears to be around in the ground. But quite a few bits of chuff so far. Nothing worth sticking the camera on for. That's looking like a Georgie's head. It's gonna be in it. Hmm. It's looking terrible. Uh, the back's pretty much wiped. I think for the front, not so bad. Yeah, I think that's worth a little clean up, I think. Yeah, not a lot on there, but enough to see it's a Georgie third and not a bad way to start the day after about 10, 15 minutes. I'm expecting to find quite a few of these as I did last time, but I really want to find some silver ones. There must be some here. Anyway, good day to you, sir. Let's move on to the next. Hey, this is something a bit different. Yeah, I think we've got a little toy soldier here probably mostly complete. Oh, this could be quite cool. Right, I'm going to give him a delicate clean up and see what we've got. There he is. Look at this little chap. Looks like a World War I sort of uniform. His rifle on the slope arm. That's an awesome little thing. I don't find many of these because I don't do pasture that often, but that's great, isn't it? Look at that, look at his little face. There's some traces of paint on there as well. So it was painted at one point. Yeah, that's a great little thing. I wonder if there's any more of his buddies in the ground here. Nice. So I've done one little paddock. That's where I got that Georgie and the, um, and the soldier. So it's a good start. I'm feeling pretty rough today. So I'm not really going at it very hard. I feel really weak and pathetic. I don't think I've got the Rona or anything, but yeah, it's not feeling very um, strong today. So I'm going at a very slow pace, and I've got these chaps here to contend with. Have you seen they're a little bit feisty? But there's another paddock here, and I want to give it a good going over, but I'm um, concerned that I'm going to get headbutted <laughs> the entire time. <laughs> there's only one way to find out, isn't there? Right, I'm going to get digging. Right, trouble. You've been headbutting me. Look at this little headbutter. How am I supposed to detect in here if you're going to be headbutting me? Hmm? That's rude. Yeah, very rude. Are you going to behave? 
Hmm, I don't think you are. Might have to go to a different area. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Right, I've got a round in the ground <laughs> situation amongst these little devils. Oh, we can see what have we got here. Oh, it's a Georgie Six. Is that a ship half penny? Yes, it is. It was ship half penny in the goat paddock. First flopping hole. Wicked. What do you think about that then, huh? Oh dear. You are grumpy. You are going to be a pain, aren't you? I want to do a live dig, but goats are making it very difficult. <laughs> nice signal down here as well. <sighs> Guys. Right. Where can I set this? Are you going to let me do this? Are you going to let me? I don't think they're going to let me. Mm. Right, let's quickly try and do this live dig. 2021. There is a goat on the camera right now. Honestly, <laughs> extreme metal detecting with these goats. This is going to be the most awkward live dig ever get off at you uh, get off at you <laughs> they're literally all over the camera oh dear i've knocked it over again stop knocking it over it's just rude you know No. I'm asking nicely, stop knocking over the camera. Look, I've got a coin here as well. The imprint of one. Ah, oh, leave it, leave it. Here we go. Got a coin here, and it's another George V ship halfpenny, actually. And green, very green, this one, compared to the uh, orangey one. Well, that was probably the most stressful live dig. Leave the coil. Ever. Oh. Right, got around in the ground and uh, got company as per this little goat field. Oi, right, I'm watching you. This little goat field is packed with coins. What have we got here? Hmm, looks like there is some detail. It will go for a clean up. It's looking like a half penny of something. There you go, another Georgie third half penny. There's a fair bit of detail on there, but the back's even better. There you go, look. There's Britannia doing her thing. That's probably the best condition George the Third have had out of the uh, the fields around here. Yeah, that's lovely. And a third coin for not a very very big area, so it's busy. Another hole. Another round in the ground, a little bit smaller this time. Maybe a little farthing. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's nice. Oh yeah, that's lovely. It's a little Vicky one, right? Let's give that a clean up then. That's a lovely little thing. Look at the condition of that. That is perfect. What a beautiful example. Little copper farthing. Flip that daddy over. Definitely be able to get the date of this. 1862, as clear as day. That is a smashing example. Came off about 17 on the knocks. As you can see, quite deep, like most of the coins here. But yeah, it came up nicely. Oh, that is beautiful. Stonkin. What a great little meadow this is. The goats have been guarding their treasures. Right, goat field is all done. What a surprising little, I think it's a tiny little meadow. It's barely, I don't know, a quarter of an acre, maybe a fifth of an acre. It, it's tiny. And yet, what, five, six coins came out of there? What a magical little thing. But those goats, they were uh, testing my patience. <laughs> I mean, you look down and one of them's having a nibble on your coil tech flipping coil 
wire and it's like oh, jesus christ don't bite through that and then you turn around another one's having a go at your, your pinpoint and bag and then one's nipping at the back of your legs it's like crumbs it's just so stressful <laughs> but anyway i've survived goat meadow um and i'm moving back into uh, another open meadow i think sheep have got access to this but they've decided to go over, over there so that's fine um i got about half of this bit done last time and it was full of coins so um fingers crossed there'll be more to come Burned out like a wandering ember. I shone bright, and my journey was over. What I sought when I ran was back where I began. No matter the rain, no matter the storm, I'm coming home. I'm coming home. Leave open the gate, don't turn off the light, I'm coming home. I gained all that I knew for a price In the end, what I found 